What's up and what's good, everybody? It's your girl, Abby Rose, and I am back with another video. Hi, my favorite people in the whole wide world. I missed y'all. Did y'all miss me? Because I missed y'all. But today is one of those videos where you guys have been asking me and 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 asking me to do this video. You guys have been wanting to see my sneaker collection part two in so long. And I know I haven't done one because I just... It's too much work. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. It's just too much work. But today is one of those days where I felt like you guys can finally see what I have gotten in my closet so far. Like, my last sneaker collection was all the way back in, like, 2017. And I've gotten way more sneakers since then. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna get right into it, honestly. I'm only gonna show you guys seven pairs of sneakers right now because... I just don't feel like bringing on my whole shoe collection. I could just show you part three like another time. But I'm just going to show you seven pairs right now that are my all-time favorites that I wear like all the time. And we're just going to, you know, get right into it and, you know, get it popping. So the first sneaker that I recently got, this is probably like the most recent sneaker that I just got, is the um, Shadow Ones. You can already see they already got creases. This is why I don't buy um ones because i don't like the creasing and it's like as soon as you take your first step in these sneakers you're gonna crease it so it's like why am i even buying these sneakers but i like this colorway because you could wear it with anything this size i got is a size six and a half with all of my jordans i get a half size up because for some reason jordans for me they um they run a little small so this is a size six and a half these are probably one of my favorite sneakers to just put on with anything they came out on april 14th and i got them like a week later because i didn't know if i want them or not because they're ones i'm not really into ones but i decided to get them anyway because why not why not so yeah these are probably one of my favorite sneakers that i just put on with anything the creasing on them you can tell i wear i wear these all the time but at the same time like i don't but ones just crease all the time so So yeah, I wear this all the time, honestly. The second Jordans that I got are the um, Cement 3s. And they look like this. The box looks like this. It's also a six and a half. I don't remember the date that it came out. If I can remember, I will tell you guys. But they look like this. I wore these only like, I think twice that I really wore them. They still have the little thing on the inside because you know i like to keep my my sneakers fresh and clean clean you feel me <laughs> fresh and clean clean all right so the way that i lace them is i don't tie them I, I don't like tying my sneakers so i just lace them like this you know they just look like this you feel me but these i don't really wear as much because i don't know i just don't <laughs> i have so many other sneakers that i like wearing but these are six and a half and um I don't know. I forgot what date they came out, honestly. So these came out February 17th, and I got them probably like a month later. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I really was not planning on getting these because I'm not really into threes like that. I do have the um, the white threes. I forgot what they called, honestly. Don't even ask me. The white with the blue. I don't know. If you guys see my other video, you'll see what threes I'm talking about. I have the other ones, so I don't... I didn't, I'm not really into threes like that, but these were cute, so I had to get them. You feel me? So now we're going to move on to Special Forces. If you guys don't know what Special Forces are, they're basically Air Forces with like, they're like all the way high top. And I'll show you guys in a second. So these Special Air Forces that I got are like the cream with the gum bottom. Okay, you're making mad noise right now. Relax. <laughs> but these are, okay, hold up. So these are like the cream with the um, gum bottom. I have worn these before already, like at least twice, I think. And these are probably one of my favorite sneakers. Like I literally wear them with a lot of stuff and um, they make my outfits look mad trendy. So I like wearing stuff like this. Basically what you do is, you know, you buckle this right here. You feel me? And it's just like, you know, there's a strap right here. And I don't have, um, I don't know when these came out because it's not, they, were, they weren't a special release. They were just like one of those releases that I thought they were cute, so I got them. These are a size 8 in women's, and they usually true to size. That's why I got just a regular 8, because I'm an 8 in women's or a 6 in kids. But with Jordans, I have to get a size 6, so these are just a regular 8 women's. 
I have a couple outfits with these on Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you can definitely go do that, all right? It's going to be all down here for you guys. But, yeah, this is just a regular shoe that I just wear with anything, like, special forces. You can't go wrong with them. Come on now. So, most of my sneakers that I get, I usually get, like, two or three colors of them. Like, if I get a Air Force, I'm going to get another color that I like, or I'm going to get... Or if I got, like, Vans or something, I'm probably... I, I'm probably gonna get like two or three colors of the same sneaker because I, that's just who I am. But. So, speaking of that, I got another special Air Force, but it is the red one, and I'll show you guys. This one is probably my favorite special Air Force that I got because it's red with a black bottom. Like, come on. Look at this. Tell me this is not beautiful. The, this red is like a brick red like it's just dark and it's not that bright red that you see all the time on sneakers it's like one of those dark reds and then it has the black bottom right here which i love because come on now oh i just love this sneaker so much so much and i'm mad that it's about to get hot because i can't even wear this until fall again but i don't know what's that um i don't know when this came out again i just know that it came out with the patent leather collection it was another um, part of that. If you guys don't know the patent leather collection, it's the one with the black patent leather and the um, purple one. But if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, just disregard what I just said. <laughs> but yeah, so this is the red one. It's also in a size 8 women's. These were, I think, um, 190 The other special air forces was 190 The Jordans was 160 and the other Jordans was 160 also. So, yeah and just you know to throw on i really like these two these are probably one of my favorites so the last three sneakers that i'm gonna show you guys are vapor maxes and they are probably one of my sneakers one of those sneakers that i just put on with everything like i literally wear my vapor maxes everywhere i go like literally okay so let me show you guys these ones this is the multicolor gray version of the vapor max and um come on now Come on now like how can you go wrong like i had to get these like i just had to because first of all they have the check right here is 3m so if you guys don't know what 3m means that means that when you put flash on it it flashes like you know one of those things that flashes back so it, it's really a good touch on the shoe i really love it and the multi-color is very subtle like it's it's not od it's not too much color it's like one of those shoes that you could just put on with anything and that's why i really like it so these are size 8 in women's. These were 190 And um, I literally wear these with everything. Like, honestly, everything. <laughs> okay, so next Vapor Max that I have is the um, multicolor mock version, which was the first multicolor that came out. And it's this one right here. Okay, so this one was probably what, one of my first Vapor Maxes that I ever got. It was my first one. And, um... Hello, this is like the full shoe right here. I have a picture with them, I think, on Instagram. But this shoe right here was probably one of my favorites. But the only thing I don't like about this shoe is it takes a while for it to break in because this strap right here makes the shoe really tight. So, because it doesn't have any laces. It makes the shoe kind of tight. So, it takes a while for it to get comfortable and break in, especially if you're not used to wearing Vapor Maxes you're definitely not going to be used to wearing a mock vapor max so get like if you guys are planning to get like your first vapor max get the ones with the laces before you get this one because you're not going to be used to it and you're going to think that all vapor maxes are not uncomfortable because this one is tight but it's just how it is this one is a size 8 also and it was 190 also so the last vapor max that i'm gonna show today is their vapor max hyper punch so if you guys don't know what that is it is the regular vapor max with the laces but they're just in this bright bright pink color so it might look a little red on camera but it's a pink color very bright pink and it's just like the regular vapor max just in all pink color the bubble on the bottom is pink listen now let me tell y'all when this came out I literally ran downstairs and I got it. And I mean downstairs in my store because in my store is two levels. It's the men's upstairs and then downstairs is the women's. I literally ran downstairs to women's section and I got these. Like I had to like because this is like one of those shoes that you just have to get for the summer or the spring. It's like one of those sneakers that, you know, 
it's really good for hot weather. Like, I just had to get this color. Like, oh my god, Vapor Max, come on now. You're killing my pockets. You're killing my pockets. This is also a size 8, if you guys didn't know. All of my sneakers are a size 8 or a size 6 in kids. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed my little small sneaker collection part 2. If you guys want to see a part 3, oh my goodness. I'll definitely show you guys in like another month because part 3 is not ready yet. You know, it's not ready yet. But very, very soon. Don't worry. Any more videos that you guys want to see from me, just let me know in the DM, uh, you feel me? And I will definitely get to it if I can. I'm trying my best to um, be on top of my videos and um, give you guys things that you want to see. So, you know, I'm trying, honey. I'm trying, all right? I'm trying. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.